Our program helps students learn, build, and get certified on Google Cloud Platform. The Associate Cloud Engineer track consists of the following benefits. First, students and faculty receive a 100% discount to pursue the Architecting with Google Cloud Platform specialization on Coursera. In addition, we are also making hands-on training available in the form of self-paced labs on Quick Labs. Here again, there's a 100% discount to access the Cloud Architecture Quest and other labs. Finally, we want both students and faculty to prepare for certification. To prepare for and earn the Associate Cloud Engineer certification, faculty who have completed the specialization receive a 100% discount on the certification exam. A student discount is also available. Students who are familiar with basic concepts related to operating systems, networking, databases, and programming are good candidates for this program. What do you and your students learn in the Associate Cloud Engineer track? The Architecting with Google Cloud Platform specialization on Coursera comprises six courses. This specialization introduces learners to the comprehensive and flexible infrastructure and platform services provided by Google Cloud Platform. Through a combination of presentations, demos, and hands-on labs, learners explore and deploy solution elements, including infrastructure components such as networks, systems, and application services. This course also covers deploying practical solutions, including securely interconnecting networks, customer-supplied encryption keys, security and access management, quotas and billing, and resource monitoring. In the Cloud Architecture Quest spanning 11 hours, the labs have been curated to give learners hands-on practice with topics and services that appear in the Associate Cloud Engineer certification exam. From IAM to networking to Kubernetes engine deployment, this quest is composed of specific labs that will put your GCP knowledge to the test. In addition to this quest, learners also have access to other labs. The Associate Cloud Engineer track must be completed in 16 weeks. This slide shows a suggested timeline. Complete the Architecting with Google Cloud Platform specialization within the first nine weeks. Complete the Cloud Architecture Quest and additional hands-on labs by week 16. Complete the Associate Cloud Engineer certification exam before the voucher expiration date. Students can definitely race ahead of the timeline. Learners completing the Architecting with Google Cloud Platform specialization will earn a Coursera completion certificate, which can be shared with prospective employers and a professional network. The Associate Cloud Engineer certification exam objectively measures an individual's ability to demonstrate the critical job skills required for the role. The exam duration is two hours. The format is multiple choice and multiple select. This exam must be taken in person at one of our testing center locations. For more details, visit the Associate Cloud Engineer certification webpage. Some of the faculty responsibilities are registering for and attending online onboarding sessions, enrolling and managing students on your Coursera program. Ideally, your cohort has 60 to 200 students per faculty. Monitoring students' learning progress and nudging students who may be falling behind. Conducting study jams to support students' learning progress Study jams are essentially workshops that you conduct with your students. Earning your Associate Cloud Engineer certification and encouraging students to become certified to validate technical expertise. For more information, refer to the faculty FAQs. 
Google Cloud has ensured that you as faculty are enabled to run this program successfully in your college or institution. You get administrative access on Coursera to monitor students' learning progress in real time. The Faculty Resource Center provides enhanced support to faculty with program-related materials, including student FAQs and a guide on conducting study jams. Your students will also get access to a Student Resource Center. Faculty and students can contact the Coursera and Quick Lab support teams for any platform-related issues.